Hi there, it's uh, Inhibition Insights. Welcome to this channel. And now come to this is hi there, innovative mind. Like here, your cursor is moving and some color shadow. It's a circular color shadow. You can, if you clearly visu visualize this side, here is the three circle of band which is moving with the cursor effect, like this way so here first of all come to the cursor cursor is the identification of the program it's a actually pug code hpug code so here cursor dot cursor means the id of the html shape is id of the html and the shape shape one shape two shape three this is the subdomain id inside the shape id so next come to the content so here is the SCSS, it's the extended version of CSS style sheets. So first come to the body and moon strat shans ray, it's a font style. Then come to the shapes like position is relative and height is VA is barometer and width is 100 barometer. So now come to the background of this effect is like here is the uh, whitening effect and now come to the border radius is 50 percent now shapes is like here is the three circle is showing inside this animation like which is following the cursor that three circle is comes under shape one shape two and shape three so you can see the color has changed for the text so that's why we need to use the three circle and the shapes one is like you can visualize the color like hash zero zero five double fe this is the color fontile extension and now come to the is dollars and color size and shapes so here is some algorithm is used for the cursor moving so here you can see when the cursor is moved on the screen it's changing the color of the text it's not changing because the shadow is come to the color shadow circle and the text is converted into that uh, color So here next is the content like the centralized box or the where the text is staying inside the screen. This is the content and you can see the mixed blend mode is used inside the screen. And now include the RF120. This is actually define the color of the text when the shadow is not moving. Now selection is color hash triple F means the background color like uh, whitening. And this is the end of CSS and now come to the Babel JS. Babel JS is really very important or very flexible. Uh, programming structure for the javascript so here you can see just constant mouse x like evt event dot client x means when your cursor is on the screen just when you moving uh, right and left up and down it's just moving like x axis and y axis that's it so thanks for watching this video uh, hope you guys like this simplest animation and this is really very interesting for our website designing and very helpful